show you what we are waking up to. You can see that long line of thunderstorms that does stretch from the Lone Star State all the way through Arkansas and up into the Great Lakes. Now, along this cold front, we do have some heavy rain that's been falling overnight in Arkansas. A couple flash flood warnings out there, so please take some extra caution, especially as you start your morning drive when we still have darkness out there. You don't want to get yourself into a situation where you could be running into some flooded roads. Currently in North Texas, not tracking any flood warnings, but a lot of thunder, a lot of lightning. So if you hear that rumble of thunder, take that extra caution. The flood warnings that we're tracking are in Arkansas, Logan, Scott, Yell County. These flood warnings are up until about 5.55 in the morning, right over Plainview and Russellville. We've had a lot of rain in a short amount of time. So especially before we get to sunrise, watch out for those roads that typically flood. If you're under a flash flood warning, you could likely run into high water. If you do encounter high water in Arkansas this morning, turn around, don't drown, find another route. Stretching up this cold front into the north, you can see these thunderstorms stretching from Tennessee into Kentucky. Some rain moving its way through Indianapolis. None of this is severe, but it's an inconvenient way to start your Monday, so allow for those wet roads. You do need extra time for your morning drive. Our future track model keeps these thunderstorms in place throughout the morning. As we go to the afternoon, the line starts to move south through Texas. So southeast Texas, Houston, also Beaumont, you guys are going to see more rain and thunderstorms as we go into the afternoon umbrellas they're going to be your best friend that line of storms extends through mississippi also middle tennessee and as we go into tonight's forecast parts of the northeast will see some showers and storms from this cold front meanwhile south texas continues to be a focused spot with some heavier rainfall possible closer to corpus christi and also brownsville as we go into your tuesday night forecast still clearing that cold front off to the east so this is a slow crawling cold front but behind it we finally do clear out by the time we end up to Wednesday. Look at the amount of rain that we're looking at, especially out for Texas. South Texas, the potential of three to five inches. Some spots outside of Corpus Christi could reach up to five to six. As we look at North Texas, we're seeing improved conditions there, but in Southeast Texas with this cold front slowly sinking down to the south, parts of Southeast Texas could easily stack up over three inches of rain. We do have flood watches out for southern portions of Missouri, Arkansas, moving into Oklahoma and also North Texas. That is up through later this morning, so hopefully we see some improvement with the flooding that we've been seeing in Arkansas this morning as we get closer to 9, 10 o'clock. I'm Amy Freeze. Welcome to Fox Weather's YouTube page. We have more great videos on the way, so make sure to subscribe to stay updated on all things weather.